Hey man. Hey man. So we're standing on scaffolding right now. Sweet. Why? <laughs> to explore masculinity, Jim. We weren't built like builders, but we can try the man talk over a tea break thing. Oh, okay, kind of like a, like a metaphor. Sort of. Josh, I thought it was meant to be a real talk, proper poem, like no hiding behind metaphors. Uh, well, like I say, it's not strictly a metaphor, and technically we're not behind it, we're on it, but I see your point, Jim, just, just go with it. Okay, Josh. Okay, so for example, that girl down there is severely fit. <laughs> Agreed. Now I want to articulate. That. I want to articulate that in a way that's, in a way that's reckless, in a way that's, you wait, know, reasonable. Wait, whoa, whoa, as well. whoa, 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 reckless. Yeah, reckless. You know, James Dean, rebel without a cause. Girls love that sort of thing. Sure. <laughs> okay, so the classic opening line, Jim, is. <coughs> Oi! <laughs> Darling! <laughs> now it's been done, but it's a classic and you never mess with a classic, so that's my opening line. What about you, man? Actually, man, I have a girlfriend. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Who used to say that just because you may or may not have a girlfriend? Oh, I definitely have a girlfriend, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but who's to say that that should stop you from looking at other girls or talking to other girls or shouting at girls from scaffolding? Uh, yeah, I just feel it's kind of a bit greedy. Like, <laughs> like a child that took the last ice cream and still wants more. The thing is with ice cream though, Jim. You can always manage another ice cream. Actually, Josh, I like to enjoy my one ice cream. On, don't tell me that you've never had the second ice cream craving. Josh! <laughs> Josh! Too much ice cream can make you incredibly poorly. Look, is this just about how much ice cream I can handle compared to you? Look, Josh, if it wasn't about ice cream, I went to the shop ten minutes ago. It's not about ice cream, Jim. What is it about? It's a simile. Simile? <laughs> More like simmer down. <laughs> how can I simmer down, man? Nottingham is doused in petrol and I'm a match. <laughs> Have you, uh, you informed the council about that one, mate? Jim, it's a metaphor. Metaphor, right, okay. Um, oh, what's that, some kind of cute mantra? It's more of a philosophy. Philosophy? Oh, well, go on then, Socrates! <laughs> I don't know, man, maybe it's not a philosophy. I just know that I don't want to miss out on chances. And neither should you. Come out with us tonight. Tonight? Yeah. Come on, man. Well, where are you going? I don't know. Don't matter. Somewhere with cheap tequila and loads of girls. Good well, <laughs> <laughs> What about... Jim, you don't have to do anything. You don't even have to speak to any girls. Just come on, man up. What? Man up. <laughs> man up. Well, you're hardly the shining beacon of masculinity right now, Jim. <laughs> What do you mean? What does being a man look like anyway? Being a man is a pint or ten on match day. It's turning down the sound and doing your own commentary. Uh, being a man is throwing a house party and forgetting to invite your feelings. It's finding the guy that punched you in the scrum and shaking his hand because, hey, I would punch me too. It's not knowing what to do on a dance floor filled with other men. <laughs> it's, it's putting out your own fires first. It's hand-holding only foreplay. It's knowing she has to save herself. It's crying only at appropriate moments. It's crying at the Les Mis film. <laughs> Two minutes into the actually is not an appropriate moment. It's starting a standing <laughs> ovation in Nottingham Scenery World. <laughs> Have some flowers. They will say it way better than I ever could. It's forgetting the words of the poem, but saying something anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go watch Man vs. Food now! It's, what do you mean, I'm too drunk to get in? Must just make such good hiding places. Maybe you're too sober to fully appreciate what I'm trying to do here. <laughs> <laughs>
Being a man is appreciating the inability to grow meaningful facial hair. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh, Josh. Yeah. If this is a tea break. A metaphorical tea break. If this is a metaphorical tea break, uh, how long exactly is this metaphorical tea break? <laughs> well, to be fair, I've just about finished my metaphorical tea. Ah. Yeah, so have I, actually. <laughs> uh, cool. Well, see you later then, man. See you, man. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs>